relevant. The deployment of the future UN stabilization force in a very um, dangerous um, 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 territory where the enemy is not clear. Um, there is no peace agreement. It's not clear who the enemies are. And also, um, it's, the situation goes way beyond Mali. And Mali cannot be asked to solve all the regional insecurity dilemmas that go way beyond Mali and also deal with the Sahil, Sahil um, question as well. Elections are necessary to end the, the transition, but they can't be at any cost. That while we recognize that there has to be an, a, an attempt to bring back a semblance of order and democracy in the country, um, that, the, that the moment may not necessarily be ripe for, any, um, for elections, and that a number of steps need to be taken before that process unfolds. Of the ICG, and not, is not a We're careful to announce that there's some kind of victory over the jihadist groups. These are groups that are highly mobile. Um, they're very nomadic. And I think the French will be the first to say that they haven't gotten rid of the jihadists. And in fact, that at the one level, it's a tactical victory for the French, but they haven't been able to push or, or eradicate um, these various groups in, in, the, in, in northern Mali. And in a sense, most of them may have retreated to the mountainous areas. Um, at one level, what they did in January was suicidal. Um, but at another level, their, their own um, approach has been to retreat, knowing full well that there was a potential um, for an international response to their own attempts to push down to, to Bamako. I'm going to defer that question. I, I haven't done enough. Thank you very much. No,